We had the Angels and the White Sox playing today, April 29th, 2022. And before I can get into the White Sox pitching, Taylor Ward drives a ball into left field. This guy cannot be stopped. He keeps doing a large amount of damage to the teams he's playing against. He's really showing a hatred for baseballs. And man, he is just getting on base and getting runs in. So that's good to see. For the White Sox here, we got Giolito pitching. He's going to pitch for six innings, get seven hits off of him, three runs, three earned runs, a walk, seven strikeouts, and two home runs. And he did strike out Mike Trout. That's pretty good. Got to be a good pitcher to do that, don't you? But he can't strike out this guy right here. You know his name by now. I'm sure you've seen him before. That's Mr. Shohei Otani. What does he do to Giolito? Yeah, he's going to take him deep right there. Center left field, 419 feet. Wow. See you later. Otani hits a home run. I'd love to see it. He's coming back this year. I'm booking it right now. I'm sure you're going to see a lot more of these year, and I'm excited to see it. Anyways, for the Angels, we got Jimmy Herget on the mound for the starter, I guess. It was a bullpen game. I'm going to call him the starter. Anyways, he had three innings pitched, one hit, one run, one earned run, and I can't even finish what's going on before he scores because in the top of the first, the White Sox do get a hit. Well, an error hit, whatever. That's an error. But yeah, they get a run in. So anyways, he's uh, he did all right for a starter. The bullpen overall tonight had nine innings pitched, obviously. Uh, and they only got three hits off him all night. And uh, only with a one earned run from Herget earlier. So that's pretty good. A bullpen game that went really well for the Angels. Love to see it. Uh, that's because Noah had the stomach bug. Not sure what they're feeding the guys in the clubhouse, but they really need to stop that because he's like, what, the ninth player so far to get a stomach bug? And then look at this catch by Mike Trout. Wasn't that absolutely gorgeous? Look at this. It's not a home run, but man, what style and grace. He's coming back healthy. Love to see the fish man do well. There's some pain for you. Anyways, Mike Trout right here is going to hit a ground out. No, they can't field the ball. He's mad. Look at that. Can't field it, unfortunately for you. Yeah, sucks. And then Otani is going to hit another little ball. That's going to be one out. And uh, yeah, that gets uh, Otani on first now and Trout off. But then we got Rendon at the dish. What is he going to do to these guys? What is he going to do? Tony two bags strikes again. Look at this. A little blooper out into the outfield. That's going to score Otani all the way from first because of his blazing fast speed. Not right there, but earlier. And there you go. The Angels now have a 3-1 lead in the top of the sixth inning. And then we're going to skip right now to the eighth inning when Otani hits a bloop little single over the out infield. You know what I'm talking about. One of those things. And he's going to get on base, then Walsh is going to hit a double, a line drive to the right field. So close. There you go. He gets another RBI, and the Angels are now up 4-1 to one in the top of the eighth. So let's skip to the ninth. Mr. Taylor Ward strikes again by getting it over the line just barely, scoring in Velasquez and really sealing the White Sox fate there. It's 5-1, to one, and Iglesias comes in to close. He has to deal with bases loaded because of Mike Myers. And there you go. That's the whole ballgame. Angels win 5-1. to one. Thank you all for watching. Have a great night. Like and subscribe.